What's going on guys, it's Gaz here and welcome back to a brand new video. So in this video I'm going to be showing you guys all the Intel pieces on Die Machine. So let's get straight into this. So the first piece is actually just past the spawn room inside of this first room right here. It's just going to be a little radio sat on that couch. Once you have that piece, make your way up the stairs and there's going to be a workbench just here. With this one you can actually go to every single game. It will, it will eventually say once you've collected them all like there's no radios or intel at this point and that is the point that you know that you've collected all of the ones for that one so also along with this one we do have one across the pond this is also another one which you can pick up multiple times but just to just so you all know you can only pick up this piece once a game so once you pick it up you're gonna have to back out join this game up again and then you can actually pick it up once again so this next piece is just before you go down into the underground, it's just to the left of that door. It's just going to be a radio on the floor right there, you've got to go over there, pick it up, and once you've picked it up, you don't have to pick that piece up again, so that's always nice to know. So once you've got that one, you need to make your way down to where you turn on the power. Just to the left of the power, there's also going to be another radio, which is a once in a lifetime pickup. So pick that one up, and that's all you need to do with that one. So these next ones along this segment are going to be required to be going into the dark ether. So once you're in the dark ether, turn around and there's just going to be another radio on top of this box right here. Walk up to the box, pick up the radio, you don't have to pick it up again and that is all you have to do with that one. Now there's two more pieces in the dark ether which we can show you. The next piece is over here with the room with the big nuke on it. You do need to go down one of the ether tunnels, once you drop down the tunnel you will land in a little room which is behind this door right here and there's going to be a radio on the floor just to the right as you can see right there just go up to it make sure you are in the ether and just pick up that piece and you never have to pick that piece up again so this next one is actually through the, the other ether tunnel so once you've dropped down that ether tunnel you're going to be landing into the room like the, the speed cola in and there's going to be another radio on the floor just there once you pick that one up, that is all the pieces you need in the dark ether. So now you can leave the dark ether and come back into the real world. So this next set of ones is through the challenges. This is going to be completely random. It's going to be so much easier on earlier rounds. There's like three or four intel pieces you can get through the challenges. So you just have to go through all the challenges and pick them up. So these next ones you do need the key card for. Once you have the key card, go down to the room with the big nuke in it and put it in the machine right at the back. Once you put it in the machine, this piece is going to pop out, pick it up, and it's going to give you a piece right there on the screen. Once you have that, you need to make your way back to the spawn room just where we found that first radio and put that piece that we just found in that machine into the wall right here. And this is actually going to set off a trap which sucks zombies. So it's going to take about 40 kills to kill all the zombies and eventually you can go up to that door and it will blow off the door and once you've done that you can actually walk into that room and pick up the die shockwave wonder weapon once you pick that up it will give you another piece on the screen right there so pick that up and make your way up these stairs right here if you come through this door right here just through this where that zombie spawn is there's actually going to be a gas canister which is going to fly to first pick that up you don't really need that right now but just keep sucking because eventually another intel piece will fly towards you and you, then you can pick it up and that will be that piece collected so from here turn around go up these stairs and there's going to be a box here shoot it with that die shockwave it's going to knock that box off now we need to go down to where that box has been knocked off and there's actually going to be another radio piece just dropping down right there you can't see it because i've already picked it up in my in my game but that is the exact location you pick it up so that is actually all the intel locations for die machine if you are having any troubles with this make sure you drop a comment down in the comments section below and make sure you hit that subscribe button hit that like button do all that lovely jubbly stuff and i hope to you guys in the next video so thanks for watching i'm gaz and i'm out peace